today we are discussing the one more concept the double circuit transmission line up to previous we are discussing a, a single circuit transmission line now we are go to the double circuit transmission line what are the uh, disadvantages is there in single circuit transmission line now we are going to the double circuit transmission line what are the advantages is there first if you go to single first if you go to single circuit this is the transmission line this is the single circuit transmission line suppose if you go this is the r phase y phase this is the v phase the this is the v phase the radius is 2 cm this is the 220 kV operating voltage single circuit line this is called as the single circuit line 220 kV voltage single phase as 220 kV voltage single circuit transmission line this is the transmission line basically nowadays the power consumption is day by day is increasing the that corresponding power generation also we are increasing the power transmission also is increasing that purpose the capacity the capacity is increasing the capacity is increasing the capacity is increasing means already we have installed a transmission line only single circuit transmission line 220 kV 220 kV voltage now the capacity is increasing what we will do we have only two options one option is that the size of the conductor is increasing the size of the the size of the conductor is increasing means the size of the conductor is increasing means what will happen this is the conductor size this is the conductor size this is the conductor size previously uh, the radius is the 2 cm now the radius is the 4 cm now the radius is the 4 cm previously gmr is less in single circuit line this is the single circuit line single circuit line gmr is the less now we are going to the the size of the conductor is increasing means the size of the conductor is increasing means the gmr is increasing means previously radius is the 2 cm now the radius is the 4 cm obviously the gmr is increasing GMR is increased means the inductance per phase the inductance per phase is also the inductance per phase is also the inductance per how it will reduce it the inductance per phase is equal to 2 into 10 power minus 7 L and 2 into 10 power minus 7 L and of GMD by GMR this is the formula this GMR is increasing. This GMR is increasing. This inductance per phase is reducing. Inductance per phase is reducing. This is the one option. Second one, you go for the double circuit line in place of single circuit transmission line. Double circuit. Double circuit transmission line. If you go for the double circuit transmission line, to overcome this problem how double circuit transmission line is going this is the this is the double circuit transmission line. This is called as double circuit. Double circuit transmission line. The operating voltage is same. The operating voltage is same 220 kV. But the power capacity only is increasing. The power capacity is only increasing. Same operating voltage. This is the double circuit transmission line. In this double circuit transmission line. Inductance. Per phase is equal to 
2 into 10 power minus 7 ln by gmd by self gmd. This is the formula in inductance. This is the formula for the inductance. In this double circuit transmission line, in this double circuit transmission line, the gm the gmd is increasing the gmd is increasing after that gm self gmd also is increasing self gmd is also is increasing but the gmd is increasing compared to the self gmd is more increasing that is the reason the inductance for the inductance for phase it will be reduced in double circuit transmission line next if you go for the calculation how the double circuit transmission line how to calculate the gmd how to calculate the self gmd we are going for a double circuit transmission line take the one example we can how to calculate the gmd and the self gmd this is the double circuit transmission line this is the double circuit transmission line this is called r1 r2 y1 y2 b1 b2 this space is called r phase this space is called r phase this space is called r phase this space is called y phase this space is called b phase this space is called b phase here to here for example 8 meters is there 8 meters are 800 cm, 800 centimeter. 8 meters, 8 meters is also. Here to here, 6 meters. Here to here, 6 meters. Here to here, 16 meters is there. For example, uh, these values is given. But here to here, 10. Here to here, 14.3 this is the example as given in this example we can calculate the first if you go for the self gmd self gmd is equal to self gmd at r is equal to self gmd at r phase is equal to self gmd at r1 is equal to self gmd at r1 square root of 0 0.7788 into the radius is 2 cm the radius is 2 s yes, is the 8, 8 meters means 800 cm 800 cm you will get that gmd you will get this gmd gmd self gmd is equal to Self GMD at R is equal to self GMD at R1 square root of this one. You will calculate this value, you will get that self GMD. You will get this self GMD value. Next, if you go for that GMD, GMD is equal to cubic root of GMD at R, GMD at Y, GMD at B. Next, GMD at R is equal to GMD at R is equal to GMD at R is equal to square root of GMD at R1 into GMD at R2. This result it will come GMD at R1. GMD at this is called R1, GMD at R1. How to calculate? Final gap. GMD. This is called GMD at R is equal to GMD at R1. GMD at R1. How to calculate this? 4 square root of 4 square root of this is called R1. Year to year, 6. Year to year, 16. Year to year, 10. 
here to here protein point B. You will get GMD at R1, GMD, GMD at R, you will get that value. Next, if you go for the GMD at Y equal to GMD at Y1, same, 4 square root of, if you go for the Y1, this is called Y1, here is the 6, here is the 6, 6 into 6, after that, same, here to here, here to here, the value it will be same, 8, 8. Next, if you go for the GMD at B is equal to GMD at B1 is equal to 4 square root of this is called as a B1. This is called as a B1. Here to here 6. Here to here 16. Here to here, here to here. Same. 10, 14.3. You will get this all values will come. This uh, this is GMD. B and Y, Y, B, Y and R, those we can substitute, then you will get the GMD values.